Good morning. My name is John Wexler, and I am the Vice President for Enrollment Management here at Rensselaer. On behalf of our president, Dr. Shirley Ann Jackson, our faculty, our staff, our students and alumni, let me welcome you to our admitted student celebration virtually. First off, we hope all of you are staying safe and sound during these trying times. While we regret that you're not able to visit us in person on campus today, we are looking forward to seeing you and your family members. We're absolutely thrilled that you're able to join us virtually. You should know that today's virtually admitted student celebration is actually the largest attended admitted student celebration we've ever had. So we're very excited about that. I also want to congratulate each of the students out there for being admitted to Rensselaer. It is a major accomplishment being admitted to Rensselaer and you should be very proud. And we know for each of you that academically the best is still yet to come. I'm proud to say that this incoming class of 2024 entering this fall is one of the strongest academically, most socially engaged and most diverse classes we've ever had. Here's just some quick highlights on the class. We've admitted students from 56 countries and 50 states. Let me just give you a few examples of the unique backgrounds for those of you accepted to the class of 2024. One of you has, plays 10 different musical instruments. Another one of our admitted students is a 2018 and 2019 New Jersey chess champion. Another one of you is ranked number five in the country for high school esports. Another one of our admitted students performed at Carnegie Hall. One of our admitted students renovated a garage at a women's shelter to provide a playroom for those young children who live at the shelter. Another of our admitted incoming students has developed a map that is a climate control indicator. And finally, one of our admitted students was hired as a youngest member of the New England Patriots coaching staff as part of their analytics team. This is just a short list and examples of the types of students who are coming to Rensselaer. At Rensselaer, we ask, why not change the world? It is very apparent from the strength of this incoming class that you will do just that. Our next speaker has been doing just this for four years at Rensselaer. Mackenzie Laird is a senior who will be graduating this May with a BS degree in industrial and management engineering and a minor in psychology. She'll be graduating with a 3.7 GPA. Outside the classroom, Mackenzie has experienced a co-op at Hasbro where she was part of the Star Wars project management team. This past summer, she worked for Deloitte Consulting in Boston, where she was a business technology analyst intern. On campus, McKenzie's a rock star. McKenzie is the vice president of risk management for Alpha Phi Sorority. She is the mentor to students enrolled in our IPRASIS calculus program. She is a member of the Society of Women Engineers Committee. And most importantly, McKenzie is a senior student ambassador for the admissions office. McKenzie has done great things, but why don't you hear from her yourself? It is my pleasure to introduce from the class of 2020, Mackenzie Laird. Thank you, John. Hi, everyone. My name is Mackenzie Laird, and I'm a senior here at RPI. I've studied industrial management engineering over the past four years and loved every minute of it here. Being a person who loved puzzles, riddles, planning, and problem solving, I knew that engineering was the field I wanted to pursue. I originally applied as a biomedical engineer, but after looking into RPI's programs, found that industrial engineering was much more aligned with my interests. Instead of working within one specific discipline, industrial engineering allowed me to apply engineering principles and logistics to any industry or technology I wanted to pursue. Industrial engineering is often explained in many different ways. The way I like to explain it is say a mechanical engineer is working on a specific machine. Industrial engineers work on a business or process in the same way, sometimes not tangible, but still looking to fix inefficiencies or problems within a system. Since I was a freshman in high school, I knew I wanted to go to Rensselaer. I was lucky enough to see my cousin attend RPI and was so impressed by all he'd accomplished here. I saw how many amazing experiences he had from completing a year-long fellowship in Germany, interning for General Electric in New Orleans, and also working for Deloitte Consulting in New York City for a summer. I knew that I wanted to go to a university that would allow me to explore, and that's what made me decide to apply early decision to Rensselaer. Freshman year feels like forever ago, but I still cherish the memories from when I first stepped on campus. Before classes start, we have an exciting week called NRB, or Navigating Rensselaer and Beyond. During the NRB, there are no lectures, homework, or quizzes to worry about. During this week, it's a hands-on, immersive experience into your life in upstate New York. With overnight camping trips or adventures of your choosing, 
day-long events with different clubs on campus, and lots of time to get to know your fellow classmates. NRB is the perfect introduction to how you get to create your own journey at RPI. I chose to go on a three-day kayaking trip where I was able to row, hike, and camp on a tiny island in Lake George. When we got back to campus, I went on a day trip to a local beach to spend time with members from the RPI Greek Life community. I also met up with my women's mentor. I paired up a classman through the Rensselaer Women's Mentoring Program to learn where my classes were around campus. Later in the week, all of the incoming freshmen walked into downtown Troy together to learn more about our surrounding community and to start conditioning for the hilly walks around campus. This week was such a great way to meet my classmates, learn about RPS campus and the community that I would now be a part of. The rest of my freshman year was just as jam packed and exciting. I joined the Society of Women Engineers where I worked with the outreach committee to volunteer at local schools and teach young students about STEM. I also became a freshman representative for the Women's Mentoring Program, an organization that made me feel so welcome on campus and I knew I wanted to become a part of. I also played for our club volleyball team and got to travel to other colleges in the Northeast and play a sport I love while staying active. Freshman year, I also joined a sorority on campus, something I never thought I'd be interested in. But at RPI, Greek life is a strong value-based community that provides both academic and professional support. If you haven't noticed by now, a lot of the clubs that I joined were very focused in supporting women at a technical institution like Rensselaer. I firmly believe that it was with support of these organizations that set me up for such a strong success during my time in college. During my sophomore year, I completed a co-op with Hasbro in Rhode Island, where I was a project manager for the Star Wars design and development team. You would never imagine how much goes into the toys that we all love to play with. I specifically worked with the engineers and designers to ensure all our products were up to Star Wars standards. I loved being able to utilize my technical background in such a creative space. This past summer, I completed an internship with Deloitte Consulting, where I traveled all over the country through their summer scholar program. While my home office was in Boston, Massachusetts, I spent most of my time traveling through Orlando, Kansas City, Dallas, you name it. I love getting to travel and work with different dynamic project teams. My role as a consultant always varies, but it can be best explained as helping better companies better their own technologies, in turn to better serve their customers. My first project was with a major hospitality company looking to improve their IT services, and my second involved a software transformation for a large financial business. No matter the project, the goal is always to work with a company to ensure that they are performing at their very best. I was extremely grateful to receive a full-time offer from Deloitte Consulting after my internship and was able to enter my senior year knowing my plans were after graduation. Very excited, starting next September, I'll be moving to Boston to start my career. Fast forward to my senior year and everything has come together. My coursework prepared me for my co-op and internship experiences within the corporate world. My professional experiences in turn made me more connected to the material that I was learning within my classes. And the organizations I joined have allowed me to pursue my passions outside of the classroom, gain leadership experiences and allow me to feel, feel fulfilled within my work. Since you can't be here on campus today, I hope that my experiences I've shared show you just what awaits for you at Rensselaer. If I had the time, I could go on all day about how the school has helped me grow in ways that I could never have imagined. And now at the chance that I sound a little crazy, but since you guys are all in the comfort of your own homes today, I wanna to ask you all to close your eyes for just a moment. It may be difficult now, but try to imagine yourself in my shoes, a senior at RPI. Over the past four years, you have studied subjects you're incredibly passionate about, joined sports teams, clubs, and made the best friends you never even knew you would have met. You have done research, gone abroad, taken a co-op, lived in different cities, you have done so much here at RPI, and you will set out to make great advances to technology as we know it. In the year 2020, we have faced challenges we never would have dreamed of. But in four years, you have made strides to uncover new solutions. Today, you ask yourself, why not change the world? And in 2024, you will have done just that. Thank you, Mackenzie. That was great. Before I send you off to your academic sessions, I wanted to cover some important announcements. First, at Rensselaer, we want to do everything possible during these times to be able to provide you with all the information that you need in making your decision. We realize that you can't come and visit campus, so we're able to provide you with webinars on everything from financial aid, our arts program, research opportunities, and unique offerings in our, each of our schools. Second, 
We understand that the second semester of your senior year is like nothing you could have thought of. We understand that. We'll be working with each of your high schools to get your final grades, even if that means a pass-fail grade is awarded by those schools. And third, I'm excited to announce that this year, for every incoming student, we will award you with a laptop computer. Our Lenovo laptop computers are state of the art. And at Rensselaer, every student is required to come with a laptop computer, but for the first time, we will be awarding laptop computers to all new incoming students. We hope you enjoy your day. Don't forget to join us throughout the month of April on our webinars. We do look forward to seeing you on campus this fall, but for now, stay safe and stay home. It is time for me now to pass you on over to our academic sessions.